Hello guys, and welcome to what seems to be years in the making for this one title of the Tales series. Where I actually don't remember when it first debuted, but today, even though I sh actually wished I could have done this on the 10th when it originally came out, today we will be jumping into Horizon Zero Dawn. No, we'll be jumping into... Tales of Arise. I hope that the volume and my voice are well perceived uh, because I've been testing and messing with my settings like crazy just so I can make sure that everything is hunky dory. Well, I guess we'll find out for sure when uh, the game actually starts. I might have to adjust some uh, volumes as well. Uh, and if you... If my voice sounds a bit more... Uh, well, groggy in this one. Yet again, I've just woken up, so my I voice is gonna sound like crap. All right, that was actually pretty cool. That was a pretty cool opening. So I did get the uh, collector's edition. I know I didn't have to, but I did. <laughs> uh, a bit of a uh, impulsive buy. Oh no! But um, it came with a statue. I'll see if I can like put that up on the screen um, at some point after I figure out how to. Uh, so I also did buy some DLC for this. It's mainly just cosmetic and um, items and stuff, but I'm not going to use it right away if I don't have to. And I am going to keep it in English for right now, only because my Japanese is not that strong and uh, my understanding is a bit better than my, me actually speaking it, but at the same time, uh, I, I, I'm not in the mood right now to just read everything. Sorry. It's, been, it's mainly been my trope to uh, play the Tales games, usually in Japanese, if it's available to me. There is an exception of uh, Tales of Symphonia that I'm still playing through, um, but right now I'm just going to let it go. So difficulty normal. Um, queuing time. Launching on AR combos. Um, I don't even know if that. Okay, well, I'll just do short. Uh, vibration, fine. Uh, map orientation, fixed. Or relative. Hmm. 
relative. Uh, destination marker, story, I'll just keep that on. Most of these stuff I'm just going to keep on. Subtitles on, obviously. Uh, actually, oh, these is, this is the stuff I was talking about. Okay, so camera speed field is... Let's just raise it up in battle speed, and I'll put that normal. Uh, battle correction, movement, attack, reset view, volume. This is the part that... I'm like, okay, well, first time doing this, hopefully I won't need to adjust this too much. Demon Fang! You're mine! Let's make the voices a bit higher. Finished. Um... Now, button binding. This was the weird part for me when I played the demo. I've never had a Tales game that actually had the attack button be R1. This is not Dark Souls. What the heck? So, for me, this is going to be X. And it's going to be weird for a bit. I understand I'm going to be messing up with combos and everything, but... Uh, I should have actually completely uh, familiarized myself with it when I was playing the demo, but I did not. Um, I'll do prioritize frame rate. I'm more of a stickler, stickler when it comes to frame rate than it is to graphics. Actually, no. You can ask my friends and they'll probably say I'm more stickler to graphics, but <laughs> frame rate will be the, the key thing this time. Let's begin. In ages long past, it was believed that Mother Dana was indestructible and everlasting. Rena, on the other hand, was thought to be the domain of the gods, a paradise where the souls of the departed could rest forevermore. Oh, how wrong we were. We in space? Ooh. In the face of Rena's unimaginable technology, its soldiers, clad in huge, shining armor, and its fearsome beasts, known as Zoogles. The prosperity and bounty of Dana all but disappeared overnight. That was 300 years ago. The world of Dana fell under Renin rule and its new masters split the land into five distinct realms. And now today, Orbis Calaglia, one of the Renin's five realms. It is ruled over by the tyrant Balsef, Lord of the Firemaster Corps. Balls. <laughs> Unrelenting fire scorches this barren wasteland. Dust storms course over the rocks and crags, and no relief is to be found from the oppressive heat. The Danon people toil as slaves. Day after day they suffer, under the ruthless oppression of the Renin soldiers, with only one hope of escape. Death. I was about to say that. Only in death is their agony finally brought to an end. They have forgotten what it means to be free. So complete is the Renin's domination. Pretty heavy stuff right there. Oh, so is the main character a slave then? Slave setting. What are those crystals on their palms? Or their hands, I mean. Hurry up! You call that pushing? Put some back into it, embedded! I think he's doing that and more. 
I mean, such a small body. <gasps> ah! Iron mask! I- oh. <laughs> nice, nice mask. But Why iron mask, you? okay. Let me... Huh. What is this? Some kind of slave support group? Mind your own business, you worthless- Alright! Third squad! Time to regroup! Go on, get moving! Hey, wait for me! Okay. Thank you, Iron Mask. That's okay, Cole. Are you hurt? No, I'm fine. Iron Mask, you... you're bleeding. <laughs> We need to get you looked at by Doc. That bad, huh? Better safe than sorry, I suppose. That wound looks like it it's old though. The blood is like black. Actually no, I guess I guess it is red. To some extent. His name is Cole. Uh ironic. <laughs> Well, it's not a coal mine, it's just look. Mine is. I hope I get to fight that guy. Uh, so sorry, Iron Man. Iron Mask. <clears throat> sorry, I had to cut my throat. Uh, you got hurt because of me. Don't sweat it, kid. It's not like I felt anything. But that's why Doc tells me to be extra careful, doesn't he? Tells me to be extra careful, doesn't he? Yeah, but at the end of the day, I choose to stick with my neck out for you, and I don't regret a thing. So don't sweat it. Okay. Thank you, Iron Mask. That guy freaking... Huh. What a weird place to sleep. Crazy. You're not beating the crap out of him. He's sleeping on the job. The heck, man? Okay. There's I more of them. Doc's gonna like what he sees. Ah, you again. Sorry to trouble you, Doc. Hmm. Look after yourself, and there'd be no need for sorries, would there? Now sit. So, still unable to remember anything, I take it? Blank as always. Nothing but that strange dream. No face, no memories. Unable to feel pain, yet only too eager to take on everybody else's. What will we do with you? Here, let me see. You may not be able to feel pain, but that doesn't mean you can't be wounded, just like everyone else. If you're not more careful, You'll wind up dead without even realizing it one of these days. I watched another slave die today. More corpses than I care to count. Unfortunately, that's hardly a rare sight around these parts. Danans are always dying, and the Renans just watch. How long can this continue? Why doesn't anyone stand and fight? Keep your voice down, will you? If only it were so simple, my friend. There have certainly been uprisings, all right. Three centuries worth of the damn things. As for all the good they've done, take a look around and judge for yourself. <sighs> there. That should just about do it. Now, do me a favor and try to stay out of trouble so the wound doesn't open again. Doc, back when I knew nothing, you were the one who taught me just how things work around here. You know I'll always be grateful for that, but I can't just... The race is won by the calm and the steady. You're still young, and you have time. Wait for the right moment, both for yourself and the world. Work will be wrapping up for the day soon enough. Don't sit around here. 
Go out and feel the breeze against your skin. Even a slave's entitled to that. Just do me a favor and keep a low profile, all right? You stand out enough in that mask as it is. Guess I'll go back to my room. That was crazy. So he's wearing this iron mask, right? How the heck is his voice projected so clearly? <laughs> I'd imagine he'd be like, I can't stand for this. How could no one stand up and fight against these guys? Jeez. Sucks. And no one really understands what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I imagine his voice sounding like, but... No, he's he's somehow mastered the art of... Projectus voices. I'm just kidding. Uh, navigate the map in the upper right corner of the screen. Show the information about your surroundings. Press X to view full-size map. Okay. So there's something over to my left. It's probably just another area. And my room is over. Yeah. Life of a slave. Hmm. And there seems to be points of interest, which should be people, possibly, that people I can interact with. Hello, Cole. Are you okay? Thanks for saving me earlier. Dick. Uh. Oh. No, it's probably the other guy. You all look the same. Just like everyone else here. So how? What are you looking at? You looking get your? Oh. How come I don't no. have a spirit core, or face, or memories for that matter. <sighs> like worrying about it won't change anything. Oh, the spirit cores. Is that what those things are called on their hands? They're not moving. I wish I could fall asleep that easily. Get to bed embedded now. Wait, what? Get to bed embedded now? Get to bed embedded now. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're a funny guy. <laughs> no matter how... Wait, huh? That's not. Sh that should not be not mattered. Uh, no matter how tired you get, of seeing them. You can always find Rena and Link and Linagus. Interesting name. Hanging up in the sky. I hate it. It's like they're watching over us, keeping an eye on our in every move. The Linagus, especially, is something else. There's no way to we can ever hope to beat the Rena the Renans when they can build floating castles like that. Surely we just need a big enough catapult to launch us up there. That'll be fine. Get us some negatives. Ever wonder what those bright eyes like to burn all over the place? Oh. I'll tell you, it's the fuel that makes us that make us mine. No reason for us to do it. Once we do, we just take it the light up. And that's why it's not hotter. It's hotter than hell here. <laughs> uh, that's not funny. You know, it's not funny. Me trying to read the dialogue. Especially when I am still groggy voice. Um, how about this? I don't read anymore. Hmm. Seems this suppression has worked very well here. Zulgas? Or Zoogles? The Balsif. <laughs> I mean, the worst they can do is hit you. I mean, your sweet release is death anyway, right? This, you see, this guy's found a proper place to sleep. Those other guys are silly.
Sorry. I should get some rest. Oh, just give me a weapon and I will... I can't even do anything right now. Because I have no choice but to sleep. I wonder how many people have slept in this bed before me. Mine for now, but for how long? Tomorrow's another day. I guess I should get some shut eye. That's a pretty nice jingle for a place that you're in. <laughs> I better head to work. Saw it got business with the freight train today, huh? Great. You're not having much momentum after you jump. That is actually pretty bad. Great. Time to start another day toiling away. Oh, you get more momentum when you uh, run and jump. Makes I'm sense. Do this until the day I die. I'm trying to find some speedrun strats for optimal, opti for more, a uh, better way of moving. I should say. I can't. Look can't talk. Oh my blade. gosh. Let's see some work around here. The word I was trying to say was optimal. I could not get it out. Doesn't work like that, not that easily. The hell? What could have been main character is now dead. You fool, you'll never be able to make that fall with those shoes. The girl's nowhere to be found. Uh, this hurts. Hey, Bennett, did you find anything? Not yet, sir. What do they expect from us on such short notice? <laughs> No flipping way. Hey, ain't, you're... ain't no way she survived. <laughs> she landed on those. Over there! Don't move! Go now! Huh? Hurry, get moving! Stay still! You cost us a lot of trouble, you know. Now we can do this the easy way or not. <laughs> What did he do? <laughs> he didn't do anything. <laughs> okay, thank you. I was like, poor guy, he got freaking trampled on. <laughs>
I like this guy. Yeah, if that much... Look at that, she fell on top of those. <laughs> she fell on top of those, how the heck? That should have exploded as soon as she touched them. <laughs> you all missed your chance to become Lord. Which means you lot live and die for me, the mighty Balsas! <laughs> Sounds he's saying Balsack. Now hurry up and bring me Shion! Yes, sir. All hail the mighty ballsack. <laughs> Even the drinks lost its appeal. Someone's in a bad mood. Lord O'Wolsey, ruler of Orbis Calaglia. Ah, oh, but it's wild beast you prefer, isn't it? Do forgive me. Oh, wow. Volkiris. What do you want? From what I hear, you seem to be having some trouble over there in Calaglia. As a fellow lord, I merely thought to ask whether I could be of any assistance to you. Enough with the false pretense. I can tell a rat when it's sniffing around. Forgive me, I can only imagine the emotional toll failing to ascend the throne not once but twice must take. A most distressing state of affairs. Shut up! It's none of your concern. The crown contest is proceeding apace, and so quickly, I must say. It won't be long before the victor is crowned as the new sovereign. I look forward to it, and you can be sure I won't forget our little chat. Nor will I. Until next time. Don't break it. Please don't break it. That was such a nice looking freaking... Mm. Who's Alphen? Oh, is that him? Alphen, eh? Where? Oh, a terrible name. You awake? Who are you? The name's Tilsa. I'm the medical officer for the Crimson Crows. You're in one of our safe houses. Crimson I'm like a freaking Crows. mine chef. Don't tell me you've never heard of us. We're the resistance for the Danon people. We get in the way of the Bright Eyes' best laid plans. The Danon resistance? I didn't know such a thing existed. Oh, we exist all right. Though I guess we're not as famous as I thought we were. Seems like I know more about you than the other way around, Mr. Iron Mask. Is it true you can't take that thing off? Yeah. No one's ever tried. Worse is that I don't even know why I'm wearing it. That woman I was with. Oh, yeah. She's quite the character, isn't she? Zephyr should be interrogating her over in the slammer as we speak. You locked her up? Why? Why? Go take a look for yourself if you're so interested. They're interrogating her? So what the hell is going on? You locked her up? Why? Dude, she just tried to kill herself. <laughs> Actually, wait, what's over here? Mm-hmm. I knew it was a mine shaft. Hmm. Okay, so nothing was over here. 
What a waste. I would have put something over here definitely if I was a part of the uh, creation team. They use that firepower to destroy stuff, don't they? Exactly what they call bright eyes. Uh, have we met before? Bucket head who stands up to the armored soldiers. Nice to know you have respect. <laughs> and another potential main character goes down. So it wasn't a lie. The slightest touch is like being struck by lightning. What are you doing? So you're finally awake, huh? What's going on here? What did she ever mind your business? So even if you don't mean to hurt somebody, if they touch you, they get electrocuted, huh? It doesn't seem to be poison or magic. Is this the reason Balsef's soldiers were after you? <laughs> For the last several days, Balsef's forces have been getting pretty restless. When we looked into it deeper, the word thorns came up over and over again. And now, we come across Miss Prickly herself. Hmm. Drop the attitude. Did you really think we wouldn't find out anything about you, Miss Shion Imeris? <laughs> That's her name? You mean she's... What? You didn't figure it out already? Yeah, that's right. This lady's got herself a surname, which means one thing. She's a Renan, our enemy. Yeah, but she was being chased by Renan soldiers. So then why? That's exactly what we're trying to figure out. After all, aside from the clothes they wear, there's only one way to tell a Danon from a Renan, and that's whether their eyes light up or not. Ain't that right, Bright Eyes? Uh. They talk for someone who can't even use astral arts. Embedded. Don't you call us embedded! Uh. Look, you see the stone your people embedded in me? There isn't one, because we gouged them out the day we swore to rise up against your kind. I was not... That didn't sound pleasant. Not to rest until every last Faith. one of you is... We Danons may not be capable of using astral arts, but it looks like those thorns of yours won't do you much good in escaping here either. Still, inflicting pain on anyone who comes near you, that's one hell of an ability. You're wrong. You think this curse is some kind of great ability? Curse. Fair enough. All I know is Balsef must have his eye on you for a damn good reason. And until we find out why... Gosh thing, every time they say his name I think about Balsef. <laughs> they must have tracked us down. Evacuate his plan. Hurry! And bring the girl. If she gives you any trouble, wave a spear in her face. I got it. Hey, that is a very mask. bloody sword. Sorry, but right now Where's it's the rest? For themselves. What about you? I'm going to welcome our guests. Don't go dying on me. Come on, move. And don't try anything funny. You got a rusty sword. It breaks in three hits. Dull sword. It's badly in need of repair. Um. Okay, so. Hey, sweet items. What's this thing? Okay. Well, we have found out a couple of things. We have found out that the, uh, the Renans are putting people into slavery to work in these mines to, uh, mine for the stuff that they need to, uh, Enemy attack! Oh. 
crap, I don't want to get too close. Uh, are they mine to give to the bright eyes so they can make weapons of mass destruction, I'm imagining? Uh, they probably already said it, but you know me, I didn't listen. Uh, but anyway, also we found out that the main character here is Alfin, and the woman that is not able to be touched by anyone, seemingly, is named Xion. And she is also a, uh, a Renin. And the things that are on the people's hands are called embedded. I feel like I'm learning something. But we'll find out more next time on Tales of Arise. I'm Bird Guy signing off. Have a nice day, everyone, and always be merry. I gotta get used to saying that again.